Omaha when you think of Omaha? What's the first thing that comes to mind? Marlon Perkins? Yeah, I remember Mutual of <laughs> Mutual Omaha, Old yeah. Kingdom. Or maybe Steaks. We yeah. all get those Omaha Steaks. William uh, Buffett? What's his name? Warren Buffett. Warren Buffett. Yeah, yeah, he's out there. And Susan Simon's <laughs> been hanging out with Warren Buffett at his house for the last couple of days. No, but Susan, we're interested in learning more about Omaha, because I got to admit, I never thought about going there. Well, no, honestly, you know, all of those things are true about Omaha, Omaha, but it's really not fair because it doesn't do it justice. And honestly, I had the same reaction. When I found out we were coming here, it was Omaha, I was kind of like, hmm, Omaha. But I have to tell you, this is my first time here, and this is really a beautiful city, and it is a lot more than I expected, and I'll prove it to you. I talked to Deb Ward from the Convention and Visitors Bureau here, and she took us on an area called the Old Market. It's very similar to our State Street back at home. This city feels a little bit like worlds colliding like where the frontier meets contemporary art and culture. That, is it a little bit like that? That's exactly what it is. I think when people come here for the first time like yourself, they're like, whoa, I didn't realize this was a cosmopolitan city because we are a state that's rural meets um, urban. I don't know what I was expecting, but <laughs> this is not what I was expecting. Really? And I mean that in the best possible way. It sort of exceeds your expectations. We, we hear that all the time. We are a surprise destination. We're a growing destination. I mean, we were just talking CenturyLink Center, where the basketball games are being held, just was built 13 years ago. When that was built, everything started to really revitalize in the downtown area. The old market is an area that used to be old warehouses. So when the trains came here, you know, they, they stopped here before they headed west and kind of got all of their groceries and, and supplies and necessary things. Well, they kept the warehouse district the way it is, but now you've got hip boutiques in there, you've got candy shops, you've got restaurants and pubs. It's a great area for basketball fans. You're also doing an amazing job with city art. There are art pieces scattered around town, mm -hmm. some that tell your story, uh -huh. and others that are more uh, eclectic. Eclectic is a good word, contemporary. Yeah. Uh, First National Bank has a whole bronze uh, sculpture garden that, that sort of takes you on the trip of a pioneer through six blocks. You know, the uh, covered wagons sort of scare the buffalo that scare the geese, and geese are running into buildings. And it's just a fun, fun, you know, interactive way to enjoy the city. What does it mean to have the basketball tournament here? Is this a... Uh, that pretty good thing. Yeah. A couple little basketball games going on this weekend. <laughs> you know, the Wichita's of the world, the Kansas, the Indiana's uh, may have been here before uh, playing football, playing basketball, but places like Wisconsin, maybe they haven't had a taste of Omaha. And this is our opportunity to show you what we've got. So you'll come back. I will come back, and I hope, Mark and Eric, you'll come back with me. Omaha is Nebraska's largest city. The population here is just over 500,000, and it's growing every year. They also have a world-class zoo that they're very proud of here that we didn't get an opportunity to see. And, of course, the, co the um, College World Series is played in Omaha every year. So it's a very cosmopolitan place, not what I thought. I am pleasantly surprised. Have either one of you ever been here? No, I haven't. No. Mark was in Miami last week, though, and he thinks they're similar. <laughs> Very they're similar. similar. <laughs> bring us back some you steaks, are, okay? Yeah, bring some steaks bring back. Some That's steaks all we back. care about. <laughs> and, and, and two Badger wins. Thanks, Susan.